Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Hold My Nugget Studios once again for the culmination of the 2022-23 NBA season as we've reached the final series. The number one seeded Western Conference Denver Nuggets making their NBA Finals debut against the greatest underdog in NBA history, the play-in eight seed Miami Heat seeking a fourth NBA title. The former led by the two-time NBA MVP Nikola Jokic with 14 career playoff triple doubles. Only the second player since Tim Duncan in 2003 to lead his team in points, rebounds, assists, and blocks entering the NBA Finals. Flanked by Jamal Murray, averaged 32 points in the Western Conference Finals. Both of them over 25 for the entire postseason. But their opposition is a squad filled with castaways, none playing better than Caleb Martin with the highest field goal percentage this postseason on jumpers alongside the superstar Hemi Jimmy Butler leading his squad back to the NBA Finals for the second time in four years one of two NBA players ever going into the NBA Finals with more 40 point games in the playoffs than in the regular season interestingly enough the other is Jamal Murray who will be sharing the floor with them Jimmy increasing his percentage percentages in the postseason proving that he is indeed playoff Jimmy but it's time to put up or shut up it's game one of your 2023 NBA Finals game I like Commentary. I've decided to give away another Xbox X and PS5. We've did it on three different occasions, six different winners. One of these can be yours and you didn't even need to spend any money. All you gotta do is subscribe on YouTube, follow me on Instagram, literally click two buttons and you'll be entered to win. The winners will be selected at random the day after the final game of the NBA Finals. All you gotta do is subscribe to my YouTube channel and follow me on Instagram. That's it. Uh, let's get ready to rumble! Denver wins the tip like an OnlyFans roulette and Jamal Murray scores the first basket of the game. On the other end of the floor, it's Jimmy Butler answers with a jumper and Miami takes the lead on back-to-back -back Butler baskets. Robbed of two slam dunk trophies, Aaron Gordon wants to be a champion the best way possible, giving Denver the lead. Max Struess wide open for three. <laughs> Aaron Gordon would make him pay with a basket inside, then on the next trip to the paint, he'd score again. Six early points for AG. IG story fellatio, Jamal Murray would add a basket, and then Caleb Martin gets pinned by Michael Porter. Come here. Max Struess wide open for three again. I'm a brick. Aaron Gordon taking turns on each Miami Heat defender, getting baskets on everybody. Oh, wait a minute, Max Struess is wide open again. If you have light skin and you're in a Denver Nuggets jersey, your scoring percentage increases by 46%. Aaron Gordon got 12 in the first quarter. Jokic at the top of the key would find cotton field pubic hair wide open inside for the dunk. I wonder what Caleb Martin's up to. I'm a brick. Jimmy Butler scores his seventh point of the quarter, but then Manns disappeared. He wouldn't score another basket for the rest of the half. Denver would close out the quarter strong, and after 12, they lead by nine. Why so serious? To the second we go, Duncan Robinson's in the game. I'm a brick. What you doing out here with all this ass? Fuck you, Cass. I'm a brick. Haywood Highsmith would enter the game. He'd get fouled and head to the free throw line. And for Miami, a team that's been shooting magnificent from the free throw line, surely they'll make more than two tonight, right? Only fans on Instagram, Murray puts in a three. My back, my back. 63-year-old back puts in a three. Well, I'll be damned, Duncan made it. The elderly Jeff Green, still agile, puts in a floater inside to make it a 10-point lead. Who's that Pokemon? I don't know! Get your dick off my face! Get your hand out of my pocket! The light skin assassin's Team B continues to attack as Porter gets a dunk inside, Murray gets a jump shot, hold the phones, Max Struess for three. <laughs> At this rate, he's going to build more houses in the Red Cross with all those bricks. Jokic inside with a basket. Denver now leads by double digits, and Miami still can't make a basket. The lead would balloon all the way up to 15, and Max Struess is still left open for three. I'm a brick. All right, let's try this again. Struess for three. I'm a brick. 
He's missed four wide open threes. Zero for six from three. O of seven from the field. Man's not even doing cardio out there. He's gaining weight. That's how terrible he playing. If he tried to spit on the floor, his loogie would hover in the air. That's how much he missing tonight. Is that Kevin Durant on Jamal Murray's pubes? Puts in a three, and then Jokic adds another basket to make it a 17-point lead going into halftime. Why so serious? Jokic with a 10-10 double-double, Jamal Murray with 18, and Miami getting absolutely cooked in every aspect of the game. Caleb Martin, zero. Max Struess, zero. Duncan Robinson, three. Trash, trash. Out there allergic to scoring. <laughs> No, 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 Bam Bam, don't do that. To the second half we go. Adebayo with a basket. Gabe Vincent puts in a three. But then Jamal Murray with a great contest on Bam would lead to a foul on the other end and one. Despite the 7-0 run, Denver goes back up by 13. What's Jimmy up to? Fuck you, Jimmy. And, of course, we can't forget about Struess. Caleb Martin still scoreless, so he decides to hit Jamal Murray with a clothesline from hell and one for the Nuggets. Six straight points for the IG blowjob recipient. Struess is open again. Sit out here, bitch ass white boy. Ah! No, 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 Bam Bam, don't do that. Jimmy Butler gets the put back. The lead still remains double digits because Jokic is putting in threes. Fuck! Fuck you, Jimmy. Butler simply cannot score. Ankle monitor KCP wide open for three. Duncan Robinson wide open. I'm a brick. It took over 30 minutes, but Kayla Martin finally has his first bucket of this game. He and Struess combined for one of 17 from the field. You suck, you know that? Miami would go absolutely cold, and Denver would go on a run that would see their lead balloon up to 21 points. And we're still in the third quarter. It's my turn! I'm a Brit! It's my turn. I'm a Brit! Denver would lead by as much as 24 in the quarter, and they'd go into the fourth, up by 21 after Sir Thickums puts in a three. Fuck you, Cass! Entering the fourth, Denver has five players in double digits. Murray leading the way with 24 points. And the dynamic duo have scored or assisted on 69 of their team's points. Why so serious? To the fourth we go. Haywood Highsmith with a steal immediately gets Miami a bucket. Followed by a Gabe Vincent three. Then Sir Thickums, Kyle Lowry would put in a three of his own. Miami kicks off the quarter with an 8-0 run. They'd cut the deficit all the way down to 10, but much to their chagrin, they'd go cold when they had all the momentum. <laughs> Denver would push the lead back up to 16, but Miami would find heat once more. Adebayo put in a jump shot, Vincent added a layup, Butler put in a dunk, and Highsmith put in a three, and Miami cut their deficit down to nine for the first time since the second quarter. But this ain't the Boston Celtics, it's a little bit too late. Denver would seal it from the free throw line, unlike Miami, only making two this entire game, the fewest in NBA postseason history. Jokic's turnaround jumper would take the dead Namekian into the funeral home and put the nail in the coffin as Denver wins their first ever NBA Finals game and take a 1-0 lead over the Miami Heat 104-93 behind a triple-double performance from Nikola Jokic, becoming the second player to have a triple-double in their Finals debut since Jason Kidd, might I add. He and Murray both combined for 25-10. and 10. That hasn't been done since since Magic Johnson and James Worthy in 87. As Denver improves to 9-0 at home, 11-0 when leading by double digits as they dominate the Miami Heat and tell them to take out their Metro car. And get aboard the L Train. Why so serious? You mean to tell me you watched the entire video but you haven't subscribed? Hit the subscribe button and become a member on Patreon or on YouTube to get access to the Discord. We're waiting for you in the Shadow Realm. Do it! Make your dreams come true! Please! Please! What are you waiting for, huh? Oh my god.